Welcome back to the WHHI News. Sunset Murdery Club of Hilton Head Island. We have with us now Lisa Medford. She is a member. Hi, how are you? Hi, good. Thank you for having me today. Thank you for uh, coming in. I know you've already got events planned for 2024. Thinking ahead, let's start with your um, one that's going mid-January, Sneakers for Sandalwood. Is that Sneaker, right? That's correct. Sneakers for Sandalwood. So we will be giving out 100 sneaker or tennis shoes or whatever you want to call it sure. for uh, participants that will come to their normal uh, distribution. Next, I think it'll be like the middle of January, okay. and uh, this is our second time doing that. We did flip flops. We gave sand. <laughs> we did sandals for sandalwood. That's cute. Last um, last summer, and it was such a big hit, and and we saw the need, and Absolutely. so we decided to to do more and do sneakers. For That's sandals. great. Now, are you going to do like a mix for say adults and children and that kind of yes, thing? Yes. Yes. Great. And I, and they will, I think they pre-register with the And let sandals. you know sizes, yeah. that would be very yes. helpful as well. Yeah. So is that is that something you all, it comes out of the funds from Sunset Rotary that you buy these sneakers yes. for them? Oh, yes, Good we do. And then we do have some funds from the foundation. Sure. From, um, but yes, we, it's, we work, we do various fundraisers throughout the year yep. to fund all of our um, things that we give away. Yeah. Well, that sounds uh, like a great idea, of, actually. And that's just one of the uh, charities that we work with. Yeah, and you know what? I think sneakers will last maybe a little bit longer than flip-flops do sometimes and <laughs> come in very handy. <laughs> they will, especially with, with the cold that we've had no lately. No kidding, no kidding. And now in July, you've got something special that you have done before, right? Sunset Rotary has? We do, and we're really excited about this. Last, last year was our inaugural Flags for Heroes. And um, if you were here on Memorial Day and drove around or went to the uh, Veterans Park. Which is a beautiful site. It really is. Yeah, it if is. you've never been there, you really need to, to go look around. And we did it um, behind the Memorial Day service. And we had about 90 some flags and um, a field of flags. That's neat. And, and you said it's flags for heroes. Flags you for mentioned heroes. When we were mm -hmm. chatting, you said, well, yes, veterans here or no longer here, but it's well, more can, than that. You can't, it, it, that's right. We, um, it's for uh, veterans, whether it's in memory or, or honor or any um, fire, fire, Fighter. firefighters, police, nurses, or it can just be a hero in your neighborhood, somebody that, that you think is- I think that's great. That's a special person. And so you just, you donate the funds and then we will put a flag up in their honor or memory. And this year is going to be July 4th. Okay. And we'll, it'll be at the Celebration Park. Oh, that's a nice so, setting, too. So that will be more, um, so everybody can see it. It's not going to that's be tucked great. off the side. So right. will you actually have the name of that hero up with a flag, we which do. is awesome. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you can walk, so if you, if you um, donate for someone, we've got a banner that lists everybody's name. Nice. And then as we have the um, name tags, on each of the flags, oh, so great. you can walk through. Now, and if I'm also, interested, I, sure. I already can think of a hero. How do I see or get in touch with Sunset Rotary and say, "Hey, I'd love to love to get involved or get a flag for my hero"? One of our members and past presidents, John Abood, he is in charge of that, okay. and I think you've got his his number. So great. just give him a call, and Super. he'll give you the information. We'll start promoting that probably in the next month or two. We've still got some. Um, sponsorships and stuff to to figure out, but we'll be that'll Super. be and we'll be presenting. That. I'll be talking to you about it. Oh, I bet again. we'll we will see I'm you sure again, we will right, talk Lisa? About it um, soon. Tell, tell me something. You know, I I have read that rotaries are really any any organizations now they're facing challenges of getting new members involved. Uh, is that the case with Sunset Rotary? Is it a challenge? Do you think? It. I think it's a challenge. It's a challenge everywhere, and I think a lot of the younger generation, they're not quite, um, the the meeting every week, it can be a challenge with families and kids. But we um, we have, ours is a dinner meeting right. at Henchy's, and so if you want to come for dinner, or, or you can just come and not have dinner. But we do it every Monday, and that might be a good way for someone to come visit and see if it's something they'd be interested in. Meet a few people. Definitely, and it, and if you want to come, it's your first meal is complimentary, oui. so we can get to, okay. get to know you and and get to know us. Great. And we're, we're about we have about. 30 members nice and we are trying to grow it. All right, well, I wanna wish you all the best well, of luck. So Lisa much. Medford, we will see you again, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay, and I appreciate your time. All right, thank you. Thanks so much.
and we will be back in just a moment. 